Todrick Clinton, the State of Rutgers.com, here with Steve Long as head coach here at Saddlebrook High School. How you doing, coach? I'm very good. How are you? Very good, very good, coach. Talk a little bit about Stephen Long, and not only as a football player, but, but also as a person. What type of person is Rutgers getting? Uh, Steve is uh, everything that a coach looks for in a player. He's, he's got all the athletic ability, and uh, to top it off, he's a, he's a great kid. Good character, great leadership, uh, dedicated and self-motivated. Very great kid uh, Rutgers is getting. And as far as, I know he can do a lot of different things uh, out there on the football field, both offensively and defensively, but what would you say is his number one uh, characteristic as a football player? Oh, he is uh, truly aggressive and, and very physical. And, uh, you know, uh, on our field, he dominated the, uh, the league uh, and everyone we played. And just a very physical uh, uh, presence that he brought to the field every day. And, you know, it's going uh, to build up in college when he learns the game even more. And uh, he's just going to be... Uh, a player to watch. Real exciting. Now, you guys, Coach, I know you had a Cinderella uh, year this season. I mean, it looked uh, really uh, optimistic uh, from the beginning. Um, you guys fell short of the championship game uh, at the Meadowlands. But just talk a little bit about the, the role that Stephen Long played uh, in that in that effort this season. Uh, Steve, you know, um, whenever he, on offense, uh, you know, he carried the ball and 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 he just did amazing things. Uh, you know, give him the ball and he, he's going to run down the field. He's going to make moves. He's going to uh, you know, run over you in, on defense. He's, like I said, he's, he's making plays from on his side. He's scrambling across the field, chasing plays down. And uh, he just played a major role on our team and, and led by leadership, um, by example. Great job for us all around. Great, Coach. And we don't often get out to this area uh, of the state. Talk a little bit about the, the perception of Rutgers in this area. Uh, in this area, uh, you know, everyone, everyone follows Rutgers, uh, you know, and, and they all have a – they, you know, they love to follow Rutgers, and I don't know, I don't know what to say about that, but, um, you know, we're all excited that he's going there, and, and to be home in Jersey is where we can watch him and, and follow him very closely. Uh, we're very excited to, uh, to see him go there. Great, Coach. Now, talk a little bit about uh, Long's evolution uh, from coming here early on as, as a youngster uh, to what he's become now. Well, you know, Steve uh, only started playing football as a, as a freshman, so when he got here, he was uh, very clueless to the game, and, you know, he picked it up, he worked hard, and and uh, did everything he could to learn the game fast, as fast as he could. So uh, he's, he's developed tremendously over the last four years and, uh, you know, due to his self-motivation, really. And, uh, you know, he put in the time, the effort, and the dedication to, to be the best he can. And I've noticed a lot of leadership qualities in Steve Long in, in, in attempting to hold this class together after the Shiano fallout and having to replace a coach. Um, can you attest to his uh, leadership cap capabilities? Yeah, Steve is, uh, you know, not the kid who's going to give up. He's going he's gonna to do everything he can to, to, to lead and, um, you know, whether it's, you know, working the offseason and doing everything he can to help out the other players on the team. Um, he's a kid that uh, younger kids always look up to and, and follow. He, everyone loves to follow him and, and work as hard as he does. So he really sets the tone for, he sets the tone here for us and uh, expect him to do the same over there at Rutgers. Excellent. Thanks for your time, Coach. No this problem. is SOR. Signing off.